Welcome to this video in which we will be making the first part of the flange coupling. You can find the diagram with all the dimension in the description. Let's start. Select part and click OK. Now go to sketch. Select front plane, sketch. And now make a circle. Go to smart dimension. Make the diameter of our first circle as 220 millimeter. Now extrude it. Up to 22 millimeter. Okay. Now select this surface again and uh, click on sketch. Make a circle. Go to smart dimension, make the diameter as 120 millimeter. Now go to extruded boss again and extrude it up to 120 mm. Select this surface and make a circle again. This time make a circle of 100 mm dia. Go to smart dimension and select this diameter as 100 millimeter. Now we will perform extruded cut. Select through all. Click OK. Make it as plain white. Now select this surface and sketch. We will make a circle. And now go to smart dimension. Make this diameter as 20. Now set the distance between the bigger circle and the smaller circle centers as 85 millimeter okay since our sketch is underdefined so let's uh, make a vertical relation between these two points make this relation as vertical now this uh, now this is fully defined sketch select the smaller circle and select circular pattern command and uh, here select 6 These are the six circles. Now go to extruded cut and select it through all and click OK. We are almost done, but uh, let's make a chamfer at this surface. Three mm chamfer. Select this uh, corner. Now here is our first part. This is the uh, flange. We will be using this part in our upcoming videos. In our next video, we will be making nut and bolt, and then we will assemble the flange coupling and for assembly we need to save this file as a flange thanks for watching